Visual Aspects Depending on the type of data or information being conveyed, some design elements are better than others. When used in graphics, color should be used to create an aesthetically pleasing visual and should relate to, or at least not take away from the meaning of visuals in your overall design. Note that color is one of the most effective ways to convey nominal or category-based information in charts. For example, in a line chart comparing two things, if those lines and points are different colors, the audience will easily be able to identify which is which. Use contrast when comparing items. This has the effect of clearly delineating one aspect of comparison with the second. Position is the most effective and accurate method of conveying quantitative, numerical, and ordinal, ordered data in charts and for impact in graphics. Shape, like square, circle, triangle, is somewhat effective when used to communicate nominal data. It is not very effective or accurate at conveying quantitative or ordinal data. Size and length are very effective and accurate in conveying quantitative data, less so for ordinal and nominal data. Position and size. Viewed as a whole, the composition says a lot about relative importance. It's all about perception and we perceive differences in quantitative values very accurately when size or length is used. Headers are prominently displayed relatively large and at the top of the visual. Less relevant information is best located at the side and relatively small in size. Color is powerful but has its nuances. Color schemes are a subjective choice for the overall design of the visualization. One exception in subjectivity is when creating a work-related visualization. In this case, you should follow your company's branding using shades and complementary colors to complete your palette. Bold colors can convey a message, but could clash or be garish. Don't overuse bold colors. Color theory provides a good starting point when designing a visualization. In charts, shape is less effective than color for differentiating data. Have a look at this scatter chart. The squares and circles look similar at first glance. They don't really have the impact necessary to make trends stand out. If they were the same color, they would be pretty much indistinguishable. Color is really the element that brings out the differences here. So, in this video, you saw how to use visual aspects in creating a visualization.